So I'm going to um, do a short video about uh, putting the roof rack uh, on the Tesla. Uh, I'm going back to uh, to use the roof. I used to have the Tesla with the um, a tow each, uh, but uh, I uh, sent it back, and I have now a Tesla that uh, doesn't have the capacity and the ability to have a tow each. So I'm going to use uh, a roof rack for loading the kayak. So I got the Tesla Model 3 uh, genuine original uh, roof rack, uh, which we're going to uh, show how uh, we put it. On that, I will have uh, the Yakima Sweet, sweet Roll um, kayak uh, carrier, and uh, that's going to be mount on the on the bars. And uh, yeah, that will be my uh, setup with uh, with my uh, uh, Tesla. So before we start, as we know, we need to we need to put the stickers. There is a mark, and that mark is on each side of the glass roof, and you have to place the sticker that comes with the roof rack uh, according to the mark that is opposite to the one that exists on the glass roof. We done it on all four uh, uh, places. Okay, so here what you get, you get uh, everything uh, that comes with uh, uh, those cups, with uh, the nuts, with the hooks, two keys to lock it, um, uh, Allen wrench or Allen uh, key, and you have this uh, tool to lift the gasket uh, rubber that is on the roof. But I don't know if you can see, mm -hmm. so you lift the gasket and then that tool help you to to put everything here inside and basically to move it back so you can insert put it like this exactly and that's how you you pull it and you move you move the gasket back then you take one of those uh, don't know how they call it hooks and you just put it just here and yeah that is it then you can move that out you need to make sure that this is really in the right place so although it can move but there is something here that hold it and that's basically how it is we're doing it for the other four Now you have these four, four. Uh, you have these four uh, seaters, and you have uh, very simply they show you uh, the direction and where each one of them goes. So, for example, that's the front, and that goes. This one is actually where I'm standing, so that's going to come right here, and it also should sit exactly on the sticker. That's where it sits. Yeah, and you can you can see that it's sit on the edge of the sticker, and then go penetrate a little bit into the side of the roof. Then at the back, it's a bit shorter. comes here yeah. now once we have those four installed I'm gonna bring the bars and the, the nuts they recommend I think between five to six 
nanometer to tighten the the nuts not to uh, risk the glass roof to get the uh, god forbid uh, uh, cracked so this one is the is the, is the shorter one or the longer one? the longest one so this one is the shorter yeah go the other side okay Okay, this is the nut. We start to tighten the nut. You don't want to do it, you don't want to overdo it, so obviously. So you can see when you tighten it, you tighten it that direction. I didn't work. It didn't work with the nanometer. I didn't know why. I didn't want to push it. But you have a sign that is exactly on the nut and here the groove. And you always can do another half a turn. But in that case, another half a turn is it can go. But that's it. I won't go. I won't go more than that. That's it. Now we're going to put the second one. Second one goes on. I must start there. Yeah. Okay, you put it again? I think it's I think it's enough. Okay. When you lock it, now you lock it like this and now it's impossible you can't move it anymore it's stuck so that's what the lock does so a first of all uh, make sure that the nuts will not get loose and also anti-theft yeah that side And the other side, it's, not, it's all locked. I think on the right side of the car, the lock uh, is opposite than the left side of the car. That's what I think. The direction of the of the turn of the key is opposite. Yeah, it's locked now. Very flashy. Yeah, it's on. It's a little bit here. In the buttons. Yeah. Hold this. So as you can see, this is the uh, final result. I think it's very uh, chicy, very classy. It seems to be very strong. And since the Tesla is low and the back is very flat, the plan is just to put something nice here that can cover like a, I have a rug and I can push the car and with the um, sweet rolls that has a, a little wheel at the back of the saddle, the saddles that goes to the back it will be easy to to place the kayak on the car so i received the the box just uh, earlier today sweet roll yakima this is the this is the kayak carrier uh, uh, system saddle um, so that's going to go on the on the Tesla. Um, so let's open it up. 
can see how it looks like. And then I'm going to put it up on the car, ready for rolling into spring fishing 2000 and, uh, 2021. Okay. So, let's see. You get two sets of uh, your tie down uh, bow and stern. I think this is for the tie down. This is for the tie down bow and stern. And you have another two um, straps to, um, to strap the, the kayak. Yes, so it comes also with uh, something to uh, uh, fold the excess of the strap. Um, what else? So you have you have those those uh, saddle. This is the front one because it doesn't have the wheel. That I know open uh, up to eighty nine uh, millimeter. So I checked yesterday. I checked yesterday my. Uh, I checked yesterday the rails. Sorry, the the bars. And my bars are about 80, 80 millimeter, eight centimeter. So that will fit. Okay. And here you have the ability, of course, to lock it after you. Um, after you mount it. This is one. This is the second one, the front. This is the back one. The back one. It's all rubberized. It's it's very nice. Also have a lock that goes on the back of the of the car. Um, I don't know what you have here, but I suppose to have also. From what I heard, from what I uh, been told, I supposed to have keys, which call the SKS, to lock. Maybe it's here. Supposed to have the SKS to lock. Yeah. Keys are here. If you can see, this is SKS. This is the system that Yakima. Uh, works with uh, usually some of the items uh, don't come with it installed you have to buy it separately it's about uh, 20 25 quid for a set of four but uh, for the sweet walls it comes uh, already installed uh, uh, it's adapter if you have a Yakima square bar so you will use this one, or if you have a think round as well, I don't, I have the arrow as you saw, but you can put it there, and that basically goes, goes here, and it's the adapter. And you have the keys to lock the system. So yeah, that's it. We will uh, put it on the, on the roof, and then we're gonna show you how the system works to uh, load the kayak. I think you have to open it almost entirely because uh, the maximum with yeah, it will be entirely open before I can uh, lock it. Okay. 
I will not tighten it uh, completely. So this is the back. And this is here. Okay, it's quite straight on the first time. Yeah. Okay. Here it's also good. It's holding it, but the problem is that, I don't know if you can see, because of the shape of the bars, the shape of the bars, because it's very rounded here, it doesn't really catch on the, on the rubber, uh, whatever the rubber shape here is, uh, to catch different uh, type of uh, uh, flat bars. It's solid, but it's going down that one went better i don't know why maybe because of the place where i put it maybe it's a bit too maybe i need to put it a little bit here but then i don't know if it will take the width of the it's again it's whether what it will setup is uh, I try by myself to put it on the on the roof so I have this big rug the car position is it position first step is to put it on the rug and then to push it of course into the um, those uh, saddles that has the uh, the roller uh, the Yakima one um, sweet rolls my fear is the car and the fear is that since the glass is uh, uh, the roof is roof glass i just may be taking a risk here but that's step number one which is quite easy maneuver and that going to be Okay. What is it? Put it like this, and this one has to go not like this okay all right yeah. so I uh, managed to play with the saddles to bring everything into position so the kayak stands a uh, seat sorry actually on the bottom flat part and not on the side because of the shape of those uh, cradles so that's how it's going to be i think you see that it's very straight straight in the middle of the car i'm uh, gonna tight and uh, lock those uh, saddles
On each side I have uh, those uh, anchors of uh, Yakima that you buy separately here and here something like that and then yeah that can be yeah that's nice that's one It's a good product, uh, Yakima, because they give you everything that you need and also uh, everything is uh, protected with rubber. This and like that. That's strong. This is two. This is the bow and stern. The bow and stern goes like that. Okay, tidying the uh, Vow, you take this short strap with the buckle, just want it here. And the hook comes on the end side of that strap into here. It. How's the back? Do you go on a lake or at sea? Yeah. I'm, going, I'm going to the sea, not today, but I'm... Uh, Where? Um, uh, usually Su uh, Sussex, Shoreham, Brighton, oh, yeah. Seaford. That's where I go. Very impressive. Yeah, it, it takes time. First time I'm doing it, so I need to practice. Oh, right. <laughs> Otherwise it will take me I the same time. wear a life jacket. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Everything is everything secure. Okay, same way for the stern. Take this loop, connect it like this. Take the hook. Take the strap. Put it here. Put it here. Hope you can see that. This thing, what good about it? That will protect the paint. That's why they done this uh, uh, rubber or plastic, whatever it is, a tube. It's very, very important if you don't want to ruin your paint of your car. And. That's it. It's very secure. It's very strong. So this is the test drive that I'm doing. Um, just to see that uh, everything is okay. No uh, strange noises and uh, everything seems to be secured. Uh, back and front. Um, yeah, 
I'll go uh, to the dual carriageway. I'll drive 40, 50, just to see that it's okay. Excuse my hair. Uh, usually I'm with a hat, so that's the case. So thank you very much for watching. And uh, I hope you like the video. Uh, please hit the notification bell, smash the like button, and uh, I'll see you very, very soon on the water, hopefully drifting for some place and uh, having some fun. Tight lines. See you next time. So, test drive. Everything seems to be... I believe what you said. Yeah, I said this. Everything good, everything strong. Yeah.